Do your tenants ever get under your skin? Do you ever get to the point where you feel like you just want to kill them? Well, here is the story of a landlord in Las Vegas who actually did. A landlord and a tenant tend to disagree on a lot of things which is why there are leases and rental laws in existence. There are things that a tenant and the landlord must both agree to obey prior to the beginning of a tenancy. Although these precautions and legal arrangements are made prior to tenancy, there are times where both parties tend to disagree. There may come an instance where someone feels cheated, disrespected, or like the other side is taking advantage of them. This is exactly what happened on Tuesday, August 10th, when something crazy happened in Las Vegas. According to witnesses and local law enforcement, at 12.25 a.m., gunshots went off coming from a property near Strat Hotel and Casino. When law enforcement arrived, they found a woman laying in a driveway in front of a property with a severe gunshot wound. They also found a man in critical condition who had been shot nine times. Lastly, they found that a man had barricaded himself inside the residence and did not cooperate with police until after much negotiation he was then taken into custody. This man was later identified as Arnold Sanchez, a 78-year-old landlord of the property. According to witnesses and police, this is what allegedly happened. Sanchez was running out rooms to three victims in his home and had been arguing with one woman renter several days prior to not paying her rent. A witness had told Sanchez he should try to evict the tenants, but he said he would handle this his way. On Tuesday, in the middle of the night, a boyfriend of one of the victims had heard gunshots after his girlfriend left the room. He then said he saw Sanchez in the hallway shortly after, smiling and laughing. Another male tenant had heard the gunshots and ran outside his room to find Sanchez, who told him he would not be able to run from him anymore. The witness then described Sanchez going into the bedroom, a woman pleading for her life, multiple gunshots, and a man who was shot nine times emerging and running for his life. Police later found a semi-automatic handgun hidden in the bushes not far from the house. The nearby residents told police Sanchez asked him to hold the gun for him. One of the residents said he put the gun in the bushes. Sanchez is scheduled for his court hearing Wednesday morning for the murder of two women and for shooting a man nine times who was at one point in critical condition. This man is expected to survive. According to the jail and court records, Sanchez faces two murder charges and an attempted murder charge. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.